everybody in here. Oh, I've been awake since 4 a.m. It has been pouring down rain, which is a gift from God because I need more water. I do. Um, the two garbage cans are basically empty. The black uh, water barrel is, I don't know, it's got about a quarter in it and the IBC tote is only half full. So hopefully it'll rain all day long and uh, just give me lots of rain. But I noticed something in the chicken yard that is awesome. Look at you guys. Looks like I'm trying to grow a lawn, doesn't it? You know what that is? Those are sprouted microgreens. Mostly chia seeds, some flax seed, but it's all sprouting. It's all coming up, and the chickens absolutely love to eat it. I woke up this morning, and they had basically all popped through. So plenty of nice greens in here, and I'm going to keep doing it. I, I put the chia seeds and the flax seeds in along with you know any other treats that I'm giving them and with the intention basically of sprouting them and they sprout beautifully look at me I'm such a mess I haven't even brushed my hair oh well anyhow there's been some interesting things going on with Miss Pris she has found her way out into the yard several times this morning she went out I heard her baby chicks chirping and she I keep trying to bolster up the sides of that you know the netting that's in uh, separating the van and she keeps finding a way out and she just gets out she stretches her legs the leghorns mean girls they try and attack her they do they chase her around but she's like I'm faster than you and uh, so she stretches her legs goes out goes back in and then I pull the netting over and let her back in with her chicks so um, I think that's a good thing because it shows that uh, she's feeling competent that the chicks are doing okay and she's gonna be able to rejoin the flock, which is awesome. I was really worried about whether or not they'd accept her, with the exception of all three Leghorns like to chase her. Um, she is doing just fine, and Romeo is out trying to mate with her again. She's not outside right now. That's not her, is it? No, I don't think so. Nope, that's Coco. Um, anyhow, so things are going okay in that department. How are you, my boy? Come here, good boy. Oh, yes, you're such a good boy. Let me see your face. Let me see your face. Oh, he's the best dog. Look at you guys. Remember this little stick I put up for Papa to pee on? It is all of this lichen and moss is coming back to life because it's raining. And I just think it makes it look really, really beautiful. This one, too. Look at that. That is so pretty. I think that is definitely <laughs> Romeo Nasturtium. There's a couple coming up. Oops. A couple coming up. And there's several coming up here. So yeah, I'm pretty sure those are all Nasturtium. Look at look at how things are. I have been pinching off these like crazy too. Oh look. <laughs> Violas. Nasturtium in the back. Yes, look at that. That one's getting big. Gosh, this just grew overnight. Crazy. I had a strawberry somewhere. I don't know where it's at. I did have a straw. Yep, yeah, look at I got a strawberry. But we got more growing down here. Oh, this is just so wonderful, you guys. You have no idea. More flowers. This garden is going really, really great. And look how pretty it looks. Isn't that gorgeous? The calendula is growing. Yay. What's this? Mm, I don't think that's anything I want. I know it's not sage. I'm going to put a few more sage seeds down there to get that jump started. But did I put some nasturtium back here too? I don't remember. Huh. I must have. Yep. I put a few nasturtium seeds because I was just going crazy. I had uh, soaked a bunch of nasturtium seeds and... I had so many, I just started putting them down places. That's calendula. That's the nasturtium. <laughs> oh, all of this is just looking great. With the exception of the junky looking stuff that I've laid down so I don't have to walk in the mud. But everything is growing really beautifully. Look over here. Bush beans and cucumbers. I took out two of the cucumbers. And I was trying to grow cayenne in these. They weren't growing, so I pulled them. Two more planted them down in here and look at these big flowers one two three all sunflowers then I've got nasturtium growing over here and I think there may be daisies maybe daisies coming up in the front but look at this beauty berry beauty berry plant 
it's going great. All of these are doing really well except for the eggplant. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and pull those. I know I keep saying it. That eggplant plant is going great. These are jalapenos. And my banana peppers, they're all doing great too. I sure wish this one had some lichen and moss on it. It doesn't though. Oh well. And then my little herb garden is going just fine. Since it rained, I figured I'd get a load of laundry done. Yep, just a small load. Got to get some camo clean, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, so the tub filled up with water, and I just did this little bit. Did some underwear, but I'm going to show you my underwear. So it's supposed to start raining again. I have not done the rinse cycle yet, so I just got them up over my clothesline, which is my fence. And hopefully it'll rain and rinse them all out. If not, I'll just gather some water from the barrels and rinse them that way. I ordered something, and it arrived, and I'm going to show it to you right now. it out a little bit and it works I was gonna take it out again today but it's raining so that's not gonna happen but no I'm not gonna mow my entire lawn with it um, just the part you know because I blocked off this back area here just to kind of take care of that kind of stuff and so I'll cover all of this I'll do a review now I bought it for myself it wasn't sent to me um, I had considered getting a lawnmower but they're just so expensive and I figured, you know what, this one doesn't need gas, it doesn't need electricity, so I'm going to give it a try and see how it goes. Thank you, Jesus, for rinsing my clothes out so I don't have to. Aside from that, nothing else is going on here today. I'm just getting rained on. That's okay. It's starting to get a little bit chilly, so I'm going to go inside. You know what, I think I'm going to make some split pea with ham soup. Mmm, today would be a good day for that. Anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.